Greetings, everyone, and welcome to another episode of Star Wars The Old Republic, Sith Warrior Edition. We're back again with Terminus. Greetings. He says greetings. <laughs> Anyways, guys, um, in today's episode, we are hopefully going to finish up the Dromenkos story. So, without further ado, let's continue on. I believe we are fighting Mandalorians. Because you pissed her off last time. Sorry, hi. No choice. And by I had no choice, I meant I had all the choices in the world, but I chose to piss her off. Yeah, you chose the wrong answer. Shut up. There are no wrong answers. Do -do -do -do. Take that. And that. That one just got slaughtered. <laughs> Alright, anyways, so now we're headed back. That was pretty simple enough. I wonder if she's now pleased with me. And isn't angry with my decision making here. Oi! Oi, you! the respect of my grandfathers and grandmothers by defeating them in battle. Now you've earned mine. You're not Revan. Not yet, at least. But you're something. You've got my approval to join the Order. Well, thank you. On me. You'll need to talk to one more person before you head back to the compound. Find Major Pathel. He oversees security on the wall. On my way. I will be that soon. Glory to Mandalore, and glory to our master. Fair enough. <laughs> well, while we're on our way over there, have you um, seen any of the E3 of late? A little bit of it. I haven't gotten around to watching all of it. Mm, any games in particular you are interested in? Uh, that Star Wars one looks like a... The Fallen Order? Yeah. Yeah, I'm pretty excited about it. I've already pre-ordered it. <laughs> I was watching the trailer bit over and over again, seeing a bunch of people's reactions, and they were all loving it. See how they recreated the scenes, and actually put good choreography in it. Yeah, I'm pretty excited about uh, Nintendo tomorrow. Yeah. It's the one I'm looking forward to the most. Come on over. There's nothing to trouble us here, and we can speak freely. I made you better at your service. It's always wonderful to meet new initiates. The Order of Revan needs all the dedicated young people it can get. You're awfully cheerful, aren't you? A necessary condition of living on the wall, I think. Keep healthy out here, one needs spirit. I don't I know do. how well, 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 you like to conduct these interviews. Right. No point making life difficult, eh? Quite a few initiates, young officers, acolytes, and the like, think that our secret society will help them become moths or dark lords. Not like that, I presume. I find my own Is there something battle. wrong with wanting authority? <laughs> Not a thing. But you've got to seize it for yourself. And I'm confident you can do that without the Order's help. Not every initiate realizes that advancement in the Revanites does not guarantee advancement in the Empire, nor how dangerous being a Revanite really is. The Dark Council seeks to root us out. So, how do we respond? How do we answer the Empire's accusations of heresy? Hmm. We prove that we are correct. We need to show our enemies the truth. And we will, wherever we can. Not to say we shouldn't defend ourselves, but we won't become traitors to the Empire either. That's all I needed to make... Until the Shadow of Revan expansion, where we say, the screw Raymond that. Will be waiting for you. <laughs> I think it's time that I be going. Journey safely, and be proud to be a part of the Order of Revan. I love how your pet still has their shot collar on. Yeah. Not for too much longer, though. Huh. 
only just yeah, a little bit. Like... Just a little bit longer. Where we do go? Back to the compound. Ah, the compound. Lovely. Ready for departure. Yes, I'm Enjoy ready for departure. Take me away, Johnny. So I finished up Arsis on my main war the other day, like Jason back. Oh yeah, how'd that go? And even though uh, he is married to Ben. Uh, Did you start with like say Jason, and Jason still confessed her love to me. It was like, ah, girl, you know I'm with that. <laughs> That's messed up. All better. <laughs> it's like, I'm sorry, I can't. So it's like, the pilgrimage. fine, I'll go Not angrily bad. meditate in this clearing. I don't know over what there. happened out there. It's, it's like, none of my business, but the inner circle approves of your initiation. Wonderful. As it should be. You did good in this trial. Now you'll have to find someone else to show you the next stage of the journey. Excellent. My initiation will be over soon. Good luck. Every step brings you closer to the master. Get some skin lotion, dude. For real. You got ashy face going on. So much ash. Alright, now we have to go pet to Duzoon or Duzone. Jesus looking right. bastard. You really made it, didn't you? Yep. I we made it. a lot about your progress, hearing about your trials. Your initiation has not been an easy one. No, we died you or something. Challenge out. And showed you can walk Revan's path. Now you may undergo the final rite. Do I finally meet the leader? Is this where I speak to the master? Yes, you've earned your audience. The master will complete your lessons, and you'll be welcomed as a full member of the Order of Revan. This is a great privilege. The master reveals himself to no one outside the Order. Where do I find him? You may go to the master in his chamber. He'll be waiting for you. Listen to him. Obey him. Through the master, you will know the path of Revan. But yeah, you yourself are not even a force user, as you have a gun. You have a blaster, yeah. Coming and this, um, force, oddly enough, there's a, uh, at the end of this, no matter what ending we pick, light side or dark side, Vet still doesn't like it for some reason. <laughs> she disapproves of both endings. You who have died and been born, stand before me now. You have reclaimed the ancient past. Stand before me now. I see you also you bought the Revan armor set from the cartel market. Followers. Hmm. Look upon the master of the Order of Revan. <laughs> you hiding from me? Are you too afraid to show your face? Silence! This is the end of your initiation and the beginning of your true journey. You will walk the path of Revan forevermore. Enemies of the Order will force you to move in shadows. We shall keep your secret safe. The two shall keep ours. The time for subterfuge is over. Know me for who I am. There! <laughs> All that to meet up with you. I'm hardly impressed. If I wanted you to be impressed, I would have come to meet you. I apologize for the deception, and for not meeting you soon. It's not how badly the Dark Council wants me dead. The order of is everything the Dark Does she even play a part in the Shadow of Revan? Nope. See, then I will never see her again. Hmm. Part of him did. He got put in the maelstrom prison with the Jedi Freedom. And then we went and attacked him, and then that drove him mad, and he went and did all Shadow of Revan stuff. <laughs> you really think of the face of the Emperor? I do. It's the only way the world is protected. In my wife's opinion, that's the only way it makes sense. Yeah, he's building the cool right now. 
out. It takes the sound of the sound of the sound of the sound That I'll be with you momentarily. Whatever knights do is just breathe on you. That's all they do. Yeah, because they're always whispering as if there's a Sith, like, in their midst. I mean, we are, but still. Now we go back to the wall, and now we're done. Yep, we can now finally... we either do what she wants, or we say screw that and just turn them all in. I mean, there's really no point in saying screw that because we never see them again regardless, so... True, but it also could fit, and that's why we don't see them anymore, because we turned them all in. But what would be the honorable thing? That's what Zord and Feast is here. Well, you were... tasked by a higher count Sith man to expose them. Fair enough. In our short time there, we decided to stay with them. I met her. Glowing red to the go to the hangar. Yes. Destination? That way. Oh, I don't know if I, I may pull an all-nighter. I'm probably going to go, like, after we do this, whatever. Probably going to go do some dishes, because I probably need to do those. They're not piled too high, but there's a few bowls in there that just need to be washed. And then, of course, the Exodus Dominion always needs me, so I need to go on there. It seems that someone is irritated at someone else, and that's slightly alarming. <laughs> did I just pass? I did. No, I'm not, I'm not even going to... No. <laughs> no. Nope. We're not even gonna go there. People who saw it will get it. <laughs> and if they don't, they don't. Oh, here we are. Finally, we get to get our ship. Ah! Ah! Flag, like... 
they don't want me to go. Okay. Click the button. There you go. All better. Is it all better, Vent? I feel like you're lying to me. Uh, the ship, the ship. Run to it, Vet. Damn. Look at that ship's ass. And it's three times the size of a Millennium Falcon. Take a look at that. We're going in style now. That's According right. to official measurements. Go in style. Now. A reward from your cowardly Who master. Who the hell are you? Gretchen, son. Huh. Uh, that's right. You have a problem with that. That's refreshing. I won't have to beat a confession out of you before I take your life. A true Sith thanks his foe for providing an outlet for his rage. My master wanted me to thank you before I killed you. <laughs> Actions speak a louder. A true Sith lets his light say with a talking. You have that? I'll give you that. I am Lord Grafton's top assassin. He sends me to eliminate those he wants to suffer the most. Oh uh, yeah, we and did that. to kill you, friend, for murdering the son of my master. <laughs> Get to it, then. So, what are you waiting for? I, I just right turn right. around. I'm like, what are you waiting for, dude? Oh, I and instead of attacking me, he jumps over me to, like, stop my path. He could attack my backside. Apparently, I'm gonna take my switch down with him. Power of DPS pet. Uh. Goodbye. Oh, yeah, your DPS. I picked a pink, I believe. Yeah, your tank spec. I'm a rider, so I'm pure DPS. Yep, and yep. you have vent in healing mode. I don't. I have your DPS mode. Oh, so you're just like. Attacking everything. Yeah. Where I'm like the immovable wall, you are like the sword. <laughs> oh, I, did. I didn't need to have her in healing mode because you have your vet heals us. Fair enough. Alright, on the ship. Hooray! Right. Butler droid. <laughs> Butler droid? Yeah, yeah. I treat you well enough, droid. Do 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 do. Hello, droid. I mean, greetings. I am to the origin. I told him droid for this vessel. You must be my new master. Gentle, kind new master. Gentle, kind new master. HK. Five paint. Resting gentle to you. Now he looks nice. Tell me your attack protocols, droid. I was not constructed for violence. Enough to talk to you. But I am still there. I am programmed for a wide array of tasks, including but not limited to meal preparation, ship maintenance, janitorial duty, and etiquette. Etiquette? This etiquette? Class, Imperial Interceptor. Shame the ship's never got updated to, like, with armaments invite to people to your ship, vessels, like Stronghold and all that. All of the standard amenities, including your own private captain's locker for storing oh, vehicles. a nice touch they added that to Stronghold and all that. That's fair. I mean, I could see it being a nice touch. communications are accessed by the ship's holot terminal. Like, like if you, you were worried, you and, like, maybe that would, like, take away from Stronghold, so, like... Console. Like, this would just be, um, it wouldn't have any extra rooms in it or anything, so all that stuff with the strongholds would all be with the strongholds. This would just be, like, an extra spot. <laughs> just to bring people in. Time to all. see what this ship can do. Thank goodness you aren't deactivating me. I mean, good luck. I regret I am unable to offer you combat support, Master. Frankly, my chassis couldn't withstand the stress. That's if why we were using you in combat. Status, yep. Do not hesitate to call upon me. 
I will update your armor, don't worry. Whenever you are ready to depart, consult the galaxy map on your bridge. It will Where am I at on that astrogation coordinates and activate the engines. Far, far away. Shared. Ah, two VR I am I have killed hundred and two enemies with two VR eights. I have to get to twenty five hundred for the three achievements. Now time to click on the hollow terminal. Apprentice, I trust you find your Hello, Doc Barris. I mean, Barris. Hello, Doc Chungus. Doc Chungus. I hope that it serves you well. There is much to be done. My interests must be protected and my enemies destroyed. Uh -huh. Norman Carr's efforts to expose my spies and prove his Padawan's power to the Jedi Council must meet with systemic failure. You will exhaust yourself in this charge. Well, what will Where it entail? The information we siphoned from that Republic agent will now be we found. We know my spy on Narshadar was being surveilled. We know where this Padawan was discovered, where she trained, and that the Jedi have sent someone to investigate my spy on Balmora. The Padawan will have to be hunted down and destroyed. But first, you must secure my network by silencing my spies on Balmora and Narshadar. Fine. Consider them wiped from existence. Nothing less than that will be sufficient. My contacts on Balmora and Narshadar will detail what must be done. Your tasks are paramount, apprentice. Bring cruelty. Bring rage. Bring death. Ooh. I talked to that real quick. Fine, I'll talk to it. What do you want, girl? Oh, my mask came so, off. Hey, okay, hey, is this master maybe person? Maybe take this shop collar off? off? You know, as a sign of thanks for my hard work on Korriban. Hmm. Not that I don't enjoy the perpetual fear of electrocution. Hmm. You've earned it, Vet. It is not freedom, though. Wow. <laughs> Now I feel stupid for not asking sooner. If you asked sooner, you would not have gotten the shot collar removed. You asked perfect timingly. If that even makes sense. You asked at a Don't perfect worry. time. I'll try not to give you reason to slap that thing back on. <laughs> See that I you don't. I expect your loyalty to remain absolute. Right. So what happens now? Now? You will remain with me and help achieve my goals. Fantastic. Glad you could open up. We'll have to talk again sometime. <laughs> Hooray! Does she still want to talk? What the hell? That's influence for you. I guess. You know, I was a slave when I was a little options. girl. No. Before I got free. Sort of full circle, I guess. You work for a Sith, as all in the Empire do, but your collar has been removed. Right. I do appreciate the difference, believe me. My mother and sister and I were grabbed when I was little. I don't remember much of it. We worked the mines on Ryloth. Then they separated us. I hope everyone watching I got realizes that Vet uh -huh. is Bay. Then some sort of weird Vet is Bay. thing. But not on this guy. Jason is Bay on this one. I've already gotten J Vet Bay. I'm guessing your masters found you more trouble than you were worth. Haha. <laughs> yeah. So I was never gonna get Slave of the Year. Anyway, I guess you know you've moved around too much when a Sith ship starts to feel like home. You've learned to be adaptable. That's a good thing. Make the best of it? Yeah. Thanks for the talk. <laughs> the rare occasion that my guy actually takes his mask off. She has earned my respect. Oh yeah? What'd she say? They the exact same thing. So. Okay. Alright, so we are headed to Balmora. Quinn first, or do you want to take out Narsha first? 
Uh, we're just gonna go grab Balmora. Get that taken care of and whatnot. Get our manservant Quinn. Ah, you've arrived on Balmora. Excellent. Your contact there is Lieutenant Malavar Quinn. I trust you'll find him most helpful. Tell him where to go. Where can I find this man? Quinn will meet you in his offices at Silver headquarters. We will speak again as soon as he has briefed you. Alrighty then. Quinn. Here I come, little man. Doo -doo -doo. Ah, Balmora, the, the land of bullshit. The land of never ceasing war is literally. Yeah, it's literally never ceasing war here. And like half the places we have to go are on giant plateaus, so it makes the map very confusing. Mm hmm. <laughs> so Alright, oh, first yeah. planet. If my screen would load in. Come on. I'm do the plot. Our Almost class there. quest and the planet story quest. That'll give us plenty of content. We'll be here for the next six years. Nah. It should only take us like three or so more sessions. I would Love think. Two hour span. I mean, if you usually like, if you're just doing like the class mission, it takes like, be here for, like an hour. Yeah, like an hour or so. So adding this the planet mission with it, that's like two hours. So it's not bad. What's up, dude? Welcome to Balmora. Hope you're ready for a war, Captain Rigel. Imperial Conquest Consolidation Corps. When the Empire invades, we're the ones who seal the deal. Seal the deal. I suppose you're aware of the situation here on Balmora? On oh, Balmora? It's my understanding that it's some kind of battle. Yeah, if you could call a pile of bodies a battle. The Empire invaded Balmora in the last war, but we've been spinning Is that a our wheels in the mud ever scar. since. <laughs> Resistance fighters think they can Like one of those fake scar patches Balmora. that you just throw on. We're here to prove them wrong. Yes. How hard can it be to put down a few resistance? It's not just a few resistance. They're well organized and well armed, but they can be broken. Balmoran government in exile, backed by Minister of Defense Vargen, is giving us fits, backing a strong faction of the resistance. The minister is safely off planet, but if we break his allies here, we break him. We break him, we break the resistance. What do you need me to do? That's what I'm looking for. Who the hell is that other guy? Get things done. Much in right command of Davril is mastermind of fate one of what we like to call Operation Breaking Point. You'll find him in Sobrick. He's got plans to blow the Balmoran resistance sky high. I think you'll like them. Bust away. Yeah, I'm, I'm most likely, uh, I'm gonna keep Vet Blue, but I'm gonna go probably in between parts, go to Terrace, grab the other blue Vet Skin, use that one. Well, I think you're gonna have your chance now, because we're gonna end the video here. So in the next one, we're gonna meet Malabai Quinn, and go speak to Lieutenant Daverell. So, if you guys enjoyed the video, go ahead and leave a like on the video and subscribe because the support is always appreciated. Terminus, say your goodbyes. I will see you later. Aw, oh, he's so cute. <laughs> Alright guys, we will see y'all later. Take it easy.